Understanding Ice Giants, a journey through language and mythology. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore the fascinating phrase, ice giants. This topic not only enriches our vocabulary but also takes us on a journey through myth and metaphor. Ice giants is a term steeped in mythology and astronomy. Originally, it referred to mythical beings in Norse mythology, enormous creatures born of ice and frost. In modern times, it has also been adopted in astronomy to describe a type of giant planet composed mainly of icy materials like water, ammonia, and methane. These planets, like Neptune and Uranus in our solar system, are often called ice giants. The phrase, ice giants, hails from Norse mythology, where they are known as Jotnar or frost giants. These beings are often depicted as powerful and sometimes antagonistic to the gods, embodying the harshness of winter and the unyielding force of nature. In astronomy, ice giants are a classification of planets. Unlike the rocky terrestrial planets like Earth or the gas giants like Jupiter, ice giants have a unique composition. They have a rocky core, surrounded by a thick mantle of ice, a term which in this context refers not just to frozen water but also to other frozen volatiles like ammonia and methane. In literature and common speech, ice giants can be used metaphorically. It might represent something overwhelmingly powerful, insurmountably challenging, akin to the formidable nature of the mythical beings or the vast, cold planets in space. When learning such phrases, it's important to understand their context and connotations. Ice giants can be a literal reference in scientific discussions or a metaphorical expression in creative writing. Understanding the difference is key to mastering English language nuances. We hope this exploration of ice giants has been enlightening and enjoyable. Remember, Language learning is not just about words, but also about the stories and ideas they represent. Happy learning, and see you in our next video.